Hi dears, in last class we completed the chapter 7, now we will move to the chapter 8 that is compare, comparing quantities. In this chapter we are going to study about ratios and percentages, okay. Now we will move to the exercise sum. See here, first uh, exercise 8.1, first sum, find the ratio of, we are going to find out the ratio of this four sums, okay. In this I am going to work out two sums, the uh, balance two sums is homework for you, just listen here, A sum. Rupees 5 to 50 paise. Okay, I am going to find out the ratio of rupees 5 to 50 paise. 5 to 50, pa 50 paise. Okay, before going to find out the ratio, first you have to uh, see the measurement. Here, here it is in rupees, here it is in paise. So, uh, first I am changing this rupees as paise. 5 rupees equal to how many paise? Rupees 1, uh, 1 rupee equal to 100 paise. You know, like that. 5 rupee equal to 500 paise. So, here 500 paise to 50 paise. Okay. While find out in the ratio, you have to take it out this 2. You have to keep east and 50. This meaning is we can cancel this 2. Okay. 1 0 1 0 1 5 is 5. 1, 5 is 5, 0. So, the ratio is 10 is to 1. This is the ratio for A sum. Now, we will move to the next sum. Say this. This is B sum. B sum is homework for you. Isn't here? Here, 15 kg to 210 gram. So, you have to change this 15 kg to gram. 1, 1 kg equal to how many gram? 1000 gram. So, you have to multiply this 15 with 1000 and then find out the ratio. Next one, see here. 9 meter to 27 centimeters. So you have to change this equal at and then you have to find out. See here 30 days to 36 hours. 1 day equal to 24 hours. So you have to change the 30 days to hours. Okay. Now I am going to work out this sum. Just listen here. 30 days. So 30 into 24. So that it will become a hours. To 36 hours. 30 into 24, I am going to multiply here. 3, 4, 7, 12, further 2, carrying 1, 6, 7. Here we have 1, 0. So, 7, 20, has 2, 36, has. Okay. 7, 20, is 36. I am going to cancel with uh, 6 table. Just listen here. 1, 6, 6, 6. Carrying 1, so 2, 6, 12, 0, 6, 36. Again, I am cancelling with 6, six table, 1, 6, 6, 6, 2, 6, 12, 0. So, 20 is to 1. This is the ratio of D sum. Now, we will move to the second sum. In a computer lab, there are 3 computers for every 6 students. How many computers will be needed for 24 students? Okay, we will compare the lab and we will compare the Two members say to a computer like Mario Carapangala, Adla on the six students on the three computers. Six students on the three computers we know Dinsol so Ranga. So on twenty four students, give a computer we know Dinsol Kikranga. Now we will work out for six students. How many computers? Three computers, okay. So one student. One student, 3 by 6 computer. This uh, 6 will come and down. Okay. So, we need for 24 students. So, 24 student equal to, equal to 3 by 6 inch 24 computers. 6 students are 3 computer way no. One student will be in the 6 on the divide level. That is 24 student will be in the multiplication level. So, 1 6 is 6. 4, 6 are 24, 3, 4 are 12. So, we need 12 computers. This is the answer for second question. Now, we will move to the third sum. Third sum, population of Rajasthan equal to 570 lakhs and population of UP equal to 1660 lakhs. Okay, area of Rajasthan is 3 lakh and area of uh, UP is 2 lakh kilometer square. Okay, uh, then how many people are there per kilometer square in both these states? Okay, uh, in last states, lay on the one kilometer, other kilometer square, key of low people, so they are which state is less populated, less population in the state. I've been so like a now we will work out. 
so number of people live per kilometer square equal to population divided by area okay first i am going to find out for rajasthan so in rajasthan okay in rajasthan equal to population is 570 lakh area also 3 lakh okay so lakh lakh will be cancelled 1 3 is 3 1 3 is a 3 uh, 2 9 3 is a 27 0 so 190 people Apo 1 kilometer square la 190 people sirpanga in Rajasthan okay now we will find out for up in up equal to population is 1660 lakh as well as area is 2 lakh 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 will be cancelled 1 h 3 0 so 830 people okay this is the answer for first subdivision now second subdivision second subdivision is which state is less populated i will compare in this we itself we know in rajasthan is less less population so Rajasthan has less population. This is the answer for third sum. Okay, after this, the exercise 8.1 is completed. Do the homeworks. Now, in next class, we will move to the 8.2. Thank you, dears.